Hi guys, today we are going to be doing a review of a very old kit from Revell, Convair B58 Hustler. It's a huge bird as you can see, 65 and 0.4 centimeters and by 35.6 and this is a kit that I have for more than 15 years as you can tell from the box and I've moved it around I opened it uh, thought of starting it but I never did actually so I'm gonna be showing what's inside of the box of that relic so we have the instructions old school Ravel nothing interesting it's a silver bird so as you can see no particular paint scheme they have one paint scheme here but I doubt that somebody will go for that anyway so what's inside the box First, the biggest letdown of that kit is the raised panel lines, as you can see. This is something that this kit is famous for, and it's not a good thing. However, as far as I know, nobody has done a substitute for that kit. And I believe that if you want to do a Hustler, that's your only option. As you can see, for an old kit, the fit is not so bad. But having in mind this is going to be an outlasting kit, it's going to be a trouble building that decently. Let's see from where to start because in the box, as you see, it's a mess. And I'm the reason for that. So we have parts from the landing gear. You can see lower parts of the wing. Very beautiful delta wing aircraft. Here we have the transparent parts, which for some reason I never opened. Okay, those are the nozzles. I believe somebody made a resin substitute for that. We have the body again, raised panels. Detail is not a good one, but. It's an old kit that we're dealing with. The decals, they're wonderful. Uh, actually, it's 2002, so I had it probably since then, so it's 13 years, not more than the 15. Excuse me for that. Okay, let's see what else. We have uh, engine cowlings four engine big jet more engine parts and landing gear seats detail is not so bad for the time and you can consider that this is a reissue of an older kit so that wasn't a bad kit at all so that was that, the mess that I created with it, but I assume that this is a relic and it's worth it to be shown, so I hope you had fun. Thank you.